Sweat it to the truth, nothing but the truth. Put my hands on the Bible, y'all put me to the booth. Yo, what's going on with it, man? So I got a crazy one for you all today, bro. Uh, hopefully, it's not real, but it's seeming to look like it is because we starting to see it everywhere. But as you all can read the headline, it says rapper Rich Homie Quan reportedly dead from overdose at third at, at at the age of thirty four. And I got this of of uh, I got this article off MassLive.com for anybody that want to go in. Uh, check it out themselves. And the time date on it says updated as September 5th, 2024, around 3.24 uh, p.m. and published uh, September 5th, 2024, 3.19 3 p.m. Many articles uh, are saying it again. Hopefully, it's not. Hopefully, that's not real. It's not the case. Hopefully, it's just one of them uh, uh, hoax or one of them spooks or whatever they call it. But, you know, this is what this is what we get from a lot of people, but I'm about to read the article. It says, so rapper Rich Homie Kwan has reportedly died from an overdose. He was 34 years old, just got, and this is, uh, I think, Boosie, just got word. Rich Homie Kwan just OD, just talked to one the other day. Uh, of course, that's from Boosie. Uh, he said, never going to forget your smile. Badass uh, hinted at the fact that he and Kwan were working on new music as well. He was cooking up some uh we was cooking up some too and he cussed right there but the rapper wrote we got some good memories together and that will always bring a smile to my face i'm sorry for this thing right here in the way I tried to get it out the way but i mean you know y'all know how them pop-ups work uh r b singer jacques also shared the news of kwan's death on uh x formerly known as twitter rest in peace my brother rich homie kwan jacques wrote i love you for life several music outlets also posted about kwan's death including Complex and BET. Quan, whose real name was DeQuantis, Devontae Lamar, was best known for his 2005-2015 single Flex, <coughs> excuse me, which peaked at uh, number 26 on the Billboard Hot 100. Uh, born in Atlanta, Georgia, October 4th, 1989. Y'all know, you know, y'all know all the other stuff that come with it or whatnot. Uh, like I said, man, hopefully, uh hopefully that's not hopefully that's not the case uh because it's definitely a sad thing to die so young bro at the age of 34 you still got life ahead of you man i'm 33 you know what i'm saying so even none but a year none but a year older than me but i just uh um i couldn't imagine i couldn't imagine you know leaving 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 the earth so early because of uh because of something i could have controlled uh you know that was a that was a, of course if you did you can't imagine anything but y'all know what i'm saying um but but you know if this is the case even if this isn't the case uh because we see this so much in the in in our community but not only in our community in other communities as well uh young people dying from you know from from drugs bro um and it is it's it's just it's not worth it as you can see man it's not um you know people people put these things in their system uh because it you know for them it escapes reality escapes reality and you know makes them feel good uh or have to not deal with a lot of a lot of the things that they do um shoot a lot of this stuff would just go to show you that oftentimes that life that lifestyle isn't what we uh ex expected it to be you know because if it was so many people wouldn't be doing so many of the things that they you know uh that they are doing um but i hope that this be just a lesson uh to to the, to the young people anybody but specifically the young people that uh death death doesn't have no it, it doesn't wait it, it doesn't have no specific time date if it's if it's coming to get you it's coming to get you especially if you especially if you're doing things to your body that that don't that don't need to be there you know um we just we gotta be we gotta be mindful of these of these kind of things but man let's definitely keep him <coughs> excuse me let's keep him lifted 
and our prayers, his family members, uh, you know, friends, whomever, you know. Um, and let's just let's for you older people, let's talk to our younger people more about things like this. Let's let's continue to be more vocal about uh about things like this, man, because um death taking them out by the numbers, young. And um again, stuff like that can be prevented. It can be prevented, man. Um but like I said, I don't know if this is the case. Again, um this is what the news outlets are saying. Again, uh the day goes, we'll find out more information. Um but man, let me know what y'all think down in the comments and let and let me know what y'all know if you know anything as well. But uh like, share, comment, subscribe. Peace, love. I'm out. 100, 100, 100, that's all I know. Ain't taking a dime off. We working, we working, we working, and that for show. Ain't taking no time off. We serving, we serving, we serving, deliver hope. Forget all that crime talk. 100, 100, 100, that's all I go. Yeah, that be what I'm.